first round and exciting Game 7. 2K Sports proud to bring you this one. Alongside Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan. We'll see the Oklahoma City Thunder facing the Houston Rockets. And here we go with a look at the State Farm starting lineups. And one of the players we'll be seeing in this, Carmelo Anthony. Yeah, you know, even from his college days in Syracuse, Carmelo has always had the ability to step up in crunch time and more often than not, deliver. When the fourth quarter rolls around, he seems to take his game to another level. Well, with the way that Melo is able to create his own shot, Steve, off the dribble or in the post, that makes him very valuable and dangerous, particularly in the fourth quarter. I mean, he's a guy that makes it really hard to defend him because he's so versatile. Take a look at the Rockets. Now with the final deciding game right in front of them, their home crowd looking on to extort them to new heights and to the next level. Well, it's been a phenomenal series, Kevin. Let's see how much the home court advantage plays into it tonight. You know, the majority of time in these cases, the deciding game is won by the home team. Yeah, and this is as good as it gets, Steve. I am not kidding. I mean, the biggest game of the NBA season so far. I can't wait to see how this thing unfolds because I bet we've got some high drama in store. Man, this is special. Now let's send it over to Doris Burke, who was able to talk with Scott Brooks. Winning an elimination game on the road is one of the hardest tasks in the NBA, if not the hardest. But when I brought that up, he said, that's something for the fans to worry about. It's still a basketball game, just like any other. It doesn't change what we need to do to be successful. Kevin, he's right on point. Thank you, Doris. Here's Anthony, following the basket by Larry Bird. Anthony can't hit. Jordan, the pass to Baylor. And it's good, assisting on the play was Jordan. Baylor's got his first two points of the night. The Rockets have gone three of five, shooting the ball so far. Paul for three, gets the bucket. Well, Thunder have gone two or three here to start out the game. Tipped. Outside, Anthony. And just under two and a half minutes elapsed here in the first. For three. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. They're allowing a sky-high field goal percentage. That won't get not at all. They've been able to score with ease. Here's Jordan. Carmelo Anthony comes up with the rebound. Usually, if he gets to the rim, he's converting it into points. But the defense stood tall there. Well, good with the triple. Thunder trailing by 10. With the runner. Jordan can't get that one to fall. Typically, he's pretty dependable on those open jump shots. Paul with the three. Count that one. Paul's got his third basket of the night right there. And the long ball really falling for them early. And they're riding some really hot shooting. I mean, they're running ahead right now in this one. Timeout is called. First of the game for the Thunder. Well, good timeout, guys, because, uh, you know, this has been a bad run for them. He's got to get his team back on the same page and, and executing well together. Sometimes just getting the stop in the action can be enough to get a team back on track. There's something about that little pause in the intensity of the game that lets you refocus. Looking at who's out there now for the Rockets. Green, he's checked in for Lawson. Harden comes in for Carmelo Anthony. And Lewis Williams subbed in for Chris Paul. All business there, not messing around one bit. Flushed it right with one hand. He never does, Clark. He never does. <laughs> well, that's kind of his trademark, those slams like that one. Now, here is Harden. Right now averaging 15 points a game. Nine straight points for them off of wide open looks from deep. Something has to change for this deep. Yeah, they're just giving up too many easy shots out there. They've got to close out harder, get a hand up, make him put it on the floor. Baylor is screen on Williams. Here's Bird. Shaq gets to Baylor. The drive by Jordan. Gets the 14-footer to fall. Yeah, off to a rough start. Just doesn't seem to have the rhythm with his shot. Harden outside. Let's the three fly. Thunder with the rebound. Robertson dishes to Jordan. Bird left side. It's a nice passing by Oklahoma City here. Baylor, that's good. Man, he makes a lot of tremendous plays at that end of the court. We see it from him every game. 
Harden the pass to Green. A three ball. That's good. And if their last five makes all have been from long range. Yeah, and the defense has not done a good job of pressing in and denying. I mean, they're hanging back, playing on their heels. They're not being the aggressors here. And the offense is taking advantage of them. Robertson, good. Boy, they answered that three-pointer right back. It is raining threes in here now, boys. Here's Williams. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. Thunder trailing by eight. Robertson drives in from deep. Jordan cannot hit. And Houston the other wing. Tell you what, things just aren't bouncing his way this quarter. Here is Harden. A strong finish under heavy pressure all over. Harden's got five points so far. Hit his foot. And the ref's whistling a kickball. Jordan with it. Averaging 24 points per contest. And the shot is good. Six points for him. That's grace over power, guys. With that finger roll gets him two points. Impressive stuff. The three from Harden. Elgin Baylor with the rebound. Under trailing by eight. Robertson drives in. Good on the shot. Robertson's got his second basket of the night. Both sides really coming out of the gate firing here. Guys, they look like they were raring to go in this one. A lot of offense early on. Here's Harden. Power down with both hands. Watch out for Lowe. Get out of his way now. No way that he was going to slow him down. Not that time. They weren't about to take those points away from him. A different look for Oklahoma City. Anthony comes in for Green, and it's Paul in for Lou Williams. And the foul on Carmelo Anthony. That is his first foul of the game. Robertson kicks to Jordan, and he throws it down with one hand. Yeah, he went for a little extra on that one. Well, he usually doesn't finish soft, obviously. You know, he can when necessary, sure, but not that time. Not when he can throw it down like that. Great shot, and again it's Oklahoma City. He's just been dominant, trying to dig his team out of the hole. Ball outside. The Rockets with another miss. Well, they have come out of the gates with purpose and focus, just gobbling up each and every rebound. Now, Clark, they have really asserted themselves on it at last. We'll see if they can keep this going in the second quarter. Well, we have a chance. Let's go to the 2K leaderboard with the list of the best rebounding teams in the regular season. The Rockets fourth. What a tremendous regular season for them on the board. I mean, they never seemed to fade during long games and kept grabbing rebounds until the final whistle. They played 48 minutes of basketball, and they'll expect to do the same thing here in the postseason. And then they, he's checked in for the Rockets. Johnson comes in for Josh Smith. Uh, if he gets a glimpse of an opening, he's going to take it right to the rim. Harden against Jordan. Back to Nene. Ball outside. Five on the clock. Launches it. And the shot is good. Ball's got 12 in the game. Oh, they're getting scorched by all these open threes they're giving up. Yeah, it's really been the biggest pitfall for this club so far tonight. So many wide open looks for the opponent. Well, he really anchors their defense. You know, they, his teammates can lean on him. They know that he's going to be in the right spot. He's so smart, so skilled. Really the complete package at the defensive end of the floor. And Steve, he's a great post scorer. I mean, he's got moves and counter moves. Excellent footwork and battle. He really knows how to get his points down low. Catching up on the changes for Houston. Chandler comes in for Nene. And it's Lawson in for James Harden. And now the first timeout call here for the Rockets. Houston with a big group substitution here. Nene, he's checked in for Anthony. Terry comes in for Ty Lawson. Green, he's checked in for Joe Johnson. And Lewis Williams subbed in for Chris Paul. Now here's Terry. Here's the three. 
Great D that time from Stojakovic. Well contested shot, and they did an excellent job of not fouling the shooter. The defense is about effort and commitment and discipline. He's a good defender because of those things. That's right where they wanted to go with the ball on that possession. Here's Terry, following the score by Akeem Olajuwon. Launches a three, and it's Terry again missing. Now defensively, they did a great job of staying tight on it. And that's exactly what you call a high percentage hoop there. It sure is. Mm. The one-handed throwdown. Gotta love it. Williams up on top. He's guarded by Johnson. And Johnson with the block. Feeds it to Jordan. Chamberlain dishes to Jordan. Knocks it loose. Terry against Jordan. Beyond the arc. And it's Terry again missing. The Thunder with the lead. A finish. And slammed up by Jordan. Now here's Williams. Looking for his first bucket of the game. To end the run. Green, no luck. Oklahoma City's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Stojakovic, the pass to Elijah Wan, and out of bounds is the Rockets gain possession. I tell you what, that's just a major unforced error right there, guys. My goodness. And a new group in here for the Thunder. Larry Bird's checked in for Chamberlain. Baylor comes in for Peja Stojakovic. Dominique Wilkins, he's checked in for Michael Jordan. And Allen Iverson is subbed in for Magic Johnson. Just cannot find the rhythm. Still yet to hit a shot this quarter. Nicely done. They've really attacked effectively in transition. There's no doubt about it, Steve. Their quickness has given them an advantage. I mean, I've liked the way they've pushed the ball all game. Timeout called the Rockets. Well, they're getting way too many easy shots in the paint. So this timeout is specifically for that reason. you you got to tighten up the defense and start to make it harder for that offensive team. I know it's easier said than done, but right now it just doesn't seem like the necessary effort is there. Looking at who's out there now for the Rockets. Carmelo Anthony's checked in for Terry. Paul comes in for Green, and it's Harden in for Lou Williams. And here's Robertson, following the three from Chris Paul. Here's Elijah one. Rockets with the rebound. Baylor gets the bucket. Baylor's got his third basket of the night. And that's why you love this guy. I mean, tremendous work on the offensive boards. It just gets you second chance points. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Ball against Jordan. There's the three. And another three from Paul. Paul's got 18 points. Well, another uncontested three there. They've got to make some kind of an adjustment. I mean, they're giving up way too many open threes. But on the last five hoops, three have come off wide open three-pointers, Clark. So it's one thing to give up one, but to start giving three-pointers up in bunches, you're in big trouble. Harden can't hit. That's not an opportunity he fails to convert very often. Jordan with it. Picked up by Nene. And Jordan gets it to go. I think it's as simple as this, guys. Get him the ball. That's all you need to do. Give it to him. Call for three. And the rejection by Jordan. And the Thunder pushing it up now. And it's Elijah on with the jam. Boy, that was a violent throw down there. You're telling me. Well, you know when he goes up with both hands, it's going to go down hard. Harden kicks to Paul. Lifts up. Stolen by Bird. And the Thunder pushing it up now. Robertson guarded by Harden. And there's Robertson. That's good on the assist by Baylor. Baylor's got three assists in the game. Nene dishes to Paul. Anthony up on top. He's got eight. There's three pointers off the mark. The Thunder leading by eight. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Offensive rebound. Elijah down goes the slam. They're getting whatever they want in the paint early on. Well, doing work inside. That's why they've been able to build the lead. They've been playing um, smash mouth basketball. Here's Harden. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact and he'll shoot two. And this is his second trip to the line in the game. And the first one drops. And the Thunder making a switch here. Harden hits them both. Here's Jordan. 
He's got 16. Robertson outside. Back to Jordan. Mene on him. From 10 feet out, Jordan with the bucket. Jordan's got 18 points. Well, I'll tell you what, they are dialed in offensively, guys. I, I think they look really well prepared for this game. And they've rode that early hot streak to a big lead here in the first. And as we conclude the first quarter, a one-sided game so far. It's the Thunder up by 10. Stay with us as we get set to bring you the second quarter right after this. And welcome back to this Game 7 as we get ready to get back into the action. And what do you consider how the Thunder are doing, Steve Clark? What do you think? Yeah, everything's gone right for this club offensively. They are really putting it together. Not too many speed bumps in the road as they built this lead. They've got Chris Paul. Smith out there with Howard. Then there's Johnson. And it's Anthony in at the two-guard spot. So that's who's on the floor for the Rockets. They have really been a group of glass eaters out there today, fellas. I mean, just devouring any and all rebounds. And I think that's the difference in the game right now. A double-digit lead in that category. Boy, they've been getting a lot of their points on those mid-range jumpers. Yeah, that's a shot that can come and go. Not an easy shot, but they're doing a nice job knocking them down. Dishes it to Johnson. It's stolen by Johnson. And it's Smith missing. Terrific defense at the rim. They got right in his path. You know, that's part of what great defenders do. They get not only in your path, but in your head a little bit, too. Well, as far as jump shots go, that's as high percentage as it gets. I'm not sure how that didn't go down. The three from Anthony, and that is good. Anthony's got five points in the quarter. Well, he wasn't going to miss that. I mean, they were way too late to get to him out there. He feeds it to Stiankovic. Looks up a three. Ty Lawson, who's checked in for Joe Johnson. Then for the Thunder, Harry Bird's checked in for Chamberlain. Wilkins comes in for Pajas Stiankovic. And Allen Iverson subbed in for Magic Johnson. Anthony with it. Wilkins picks him up. Carmelo Anthony, and that's good. Anthony's got 16 points. That's four of their last five coming from long range. This offense is cooking. Yeah, it's rolling, really rolling. And defensively, they kept collapsing, Steve, and leaving them open. So now they're in trouble. They're in a real dilemma now. Rockets trail by four. The tray. It's hauled in by Bird. Bird's got three rebounds so far in the game. It's Wilkins with the drive. It's off his foot. And they're saying he kicked the ball. Houston making some changes. Harden comes in for Ty Lawson. And it's Terry in for Chris Paul. And then for Oklahoma City, Jordan comes in for Dominique Wilkins. And it's Robertson in for Allen Iverson. That's going to be over and back. Not watching for the line that time. Harden outside. Good. Harden's got 11. Yeah, when you play against him, Kevin, the first thing you want to address is making it harder on him to go to work down low. If you let him get position inside, it's going to be a long night for you. He's got plenty of sweetener in his game, a little flair in his package. Not a guy you have to call to play for. He can size you up and take you apart. It's Terry outside, and uh, Kim Olajuwon pulls it down. Olajuwon's got rebound number five here tonight. Pass to Jordan. That's tipped. Stolen by Harden. Oh, and a fast break for the Rockets. Anthony leading the charge. Jacks up a three. That is good. Anthony's got 11 points in the quarter. He had a great start from the arc, and he's kicked it up even another notch here in the second. And there's the feed to Bird. He's against Smith. Shoots it. And it's Bird missing. Good, tough defense there. Getting a hand up, forcing that miss. Well, he's got the reputation of being a tough defender, and there was an example right there for him. Kept alive. Howard. That's good. And the Rockets lead by one. And hard work on the boards, guys, leading to that putback. And the pass to Jordan. On the wing, Bird. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Jordan. Jordan's got his seventh assist in the game. Harden kicks to Smith. 
Kicks it out to Harden. He passes to Terry. Six to shoot. Left side, Terry. And he's good on the three ball. Terry's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. Outside, Baylor. He kicks to Elijah Wan, and it's going to be out of bounds. The Thunder will retain possession. We've got a chance now to show you the hottest shooting teams over the course of the regular season. In second, the Rockets. You know, this team had excellent numbers during the regular season, and I would not be surprised to see them heating up here in the postseason as well. They had a nice rhythm going as the regular season came to a close. Looking at who's out there now for the Rockets. Tyson Chandler is checked in for Howard. Nene comes in for Carmelo Anthony. Lou Williams is checked in for James Hart. And it's Ball in for Jason Terry. That's what I like. A nice, strong finish inside. That's what he does. He's got that dunker mentality. Mm, just a tremendous athlete. Guys able to go up and finish over everybody defensively, even the big guys down low. That's good. Well, that's a quality look there. The defense a bit late. And two straight now from long range, putting up points in a hurry, Clark. Passes to Russell. It's a nice passing by Oklahoma City. They get a hand on it. And that'll be Oklahoma City as it goes out of bounds. Thunder retain possession. And the Rockets making a change here. Anthony's checked in. He dishes it to Jordan. Shoots the three. That's in coming off the assist from Robertson. Robertson's got three assists in the game. Williams with the ball. Baylor picks him up. Williams with another miss. Tough three-point try there with a hand in his face. Oh, what a throw down there. Man. You know, that's something he's capable of every trip down. And it's just impossible to get tired of. Yeah, there's always this excitement, this aura that surrounds him, guys. And the, the crowd senses it. And that was Sprite bringing you the close-up on that big-time play. Well, after that great first quarter from outside, he's cooled down here. It's been said often that good defense leads to offense, and that's what we're seeing here with all these points off turnover. Yeah, because the defense doesn't have a chance to set up once they've made that turnover, so they're really taking advantage in transition. Time called here. The Thunder decide to talk it over. So for the Rockets, Green is checked in for Anthony. And it's Harden in for Chris Paul. But Thunder have gotten seven of their 12 field goal attempts to drop here in the second quarter. Up over 50%. Here's Jordan, accurate with a jumper from the elbow. Jordan's got 25 points. Boy, he's been so dependable here in this game. Really playing well offensively. Here's Williams. Williams with another miss. He may want to start spreading the ball around a little bit. His shot is off right now. Oh, oh, wow. Hammer time! Wow. Hammer time! Come on, fella! Power it down! <laughs> that dunk was ridiculous! There was, <laughs> there was absolutely nobody that was going to get in the way of that. Not when he's coming with that much force. He's been hot for most of this game, and if he keeps it up, his team could turn things around. The dish to Jordan. Kicks it to O'Neal. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. The Thunder have gone three for three at the line tonight. That's good from O'Neal. Magic Johnson, he checked in for Robertson. O'Neal hits them both. He's one of the best free throw shooters in the league, and this game, no different. He's making each trip to the line count. Harden against Johnson. Harden can't hit. Just an enormous advantage for them on the boards. Guys, the key to the lead. Oh, oh, ridiculous. Pour it down that time. <laughs> Did you see that? Oh, we got to see that one again, guys. We've got to see that again. I need a replay. I, I, I'm not sure what I just looked at. Chamberlain's checked in for the Thunder. Shooting 100% in the quarter. They've, um, they've made them all taking full advantage at the line. Well, it's a nice job of really making the most of their opportunities. 
Jordan with it. Williams picks him up. The drive by Jordan. From 13 feet, it goes down. Jordan's got 12 now in this quarter. Well, after that strong start to this game, he's really picked it up here in the second. Outside, Green. And he can't stop the run as he misses. The Thunder leading by 11. There's the bucket. Good. Soft defense right there. Way too soft. Now a timeout called by Houston. We see Michael Jordan really having a great game. He's been attacking the rim with reckless abandon. They're searching for answers. Some way they've got to figure out how to contain him. with a big root substitution here. Joe Johnson, he's checked in for Chandler. Howard comes in for Nene. Carmelo Anthony is checked in for Lou Williams. And it's Paul in for James Harden. Then for the Thunder, Elijah Wan comes in for Shaq. And it's Peja Stiakovic in for Michael Jordan. And he does it again. What can you say? The defense continues to allow him to get open out there. They've got to know that he can knock down that shot. Put somebody on him. Rockets trail by 12. Ball outside. There's the triple. But they'll get another chance. And they're going to have to make sure they box out here. Don't give up any second chance points. And that's just too easy. I mean, to rebound effectively, everybody's got to do their part. Ammonia strong finish right there, partner. <laughs> you hear me? That was ammonia strong. Yeah, ripped it down with two hands. That's about as high percentage as you can get. Anthony's shot is off. Man, right in his face on that shot. That's some airtight saran wrap D there. That's yeah, as good as a block, really, Clark. Just altering that shot, making it really impossible to shoot over that kind of defense. The Rockets shooting in the second quarter around 42%. Paul for three. Paul can't get that one to fall. He's really struggling in this quarter. Oh, get it! Oh, watch out now! <laughs> Don't do that to him. That was fantastic. <laughs> wow. And Clark, the degree of difficult major. Ooh, that was amazing. The three from Anthony. Gets it to go. Anthony's got 22 points. He's having one of the best shooting days that I can remember from outside. He's on pace for some kind of record. Knocked away. And Paul with a clear path to the hoop. And that one's good. 23 points in the game. Well, they're not shooting as many from outside here in the second quarter. Well, they were shooting well early on. I like their spacing and their offensive flow. I think they need to get back to that. Here's Chamberlain. Goes to the fadeaway and cans it. Carving them up inside there, Kevin. I mean, the defense has been vulnerable in there. Yeah, that's three straight field goals in the paint area. That's really good offense. And here's Anthony from the arc. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. You gotta love what he's doing out there, guys. With his team down, he's personally trying to bring them back. Stiakovic, the pass to Johnson. Back to Stiakovic. Outside runner. And Kirk coming off the assist by Magic Johnson. Johnson's got assist number five here tonight. Well, after a slow first quarter, he's starting to pick it up a bit here. And here's Anthony for three. The Thunder pull it in. Chamberlain got his fifth rebound in this one. And Baylor throws it down. And that's taking it strong right there. Yeah, finishing in style. Uh, you can feel a sense of anticipation when he heads for the hoop because that's what he can do. Paul with the three. And it's Howard finishing it off. Time call here. The Thunder decides to talk it over. Well, he looks like he wants to toy around with some of their sets and matchups here. You know, I don't think you can afford to go through a whole game doing the same thing over and over, and you have to be able to adjust on the fly, just like he's doing here. Houston with a big group substitution here. Tyson Chandler, who's checked in for Johnson. Nene comes in for Dwight Howard. Jason Terry is checked in for Carmelo Anthony. And it's Lawson in for Chris Paul. And a new group in here for the Thunder. Larry Bird's checked in for Elijah Wan. Wilkins comes in for Baylor. Michael Jordan is checked in for Peja Stiakovich. And it's Robertson in for Magic Johnson. 
And Terry up top, guarded by Jordan. From the arc. And Jason Terry with the three. Terry's got his second bucket of the night. Starting to get a little momentum here after that scoreless first quarter. Back to Bird. Feeds to Wilkins. Again, Oklahoma City. Offensively just hammering away in the paint. And that's 10 straight points inside, too. Lawson kicks to Terry. Right side, Terry. No good from outside. Robertson against the name. Back to Wilkins. That's in, coming off the assist from Robertson. Robertson's got assist number five here tonight. It's Terry outside. Unbelievable shot at the buzzer. Boy, this guy just... And so we conclude the first half. Thunder lead by 12. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. And we're back to the action here in this round one matchup. Jordan having a terrific game. He has nine rebounds and some big-time point production as well. You know, overall, he was really solid in the first half, definitely bringing the intensity and the heat there. Absolutely, Clark. I felt like he was an igniter, you know, just driving their offense. So with Wilkins on the bench, this is who Scott Brooks has out there. We've got Bird. Michael Jordan is out there with Robertson. Then there's Shaquille O'Neal, and it's Baylor in at the three. And that one's good. And that's now 27 points for Chris Paul. The Thunder leading by eight. And here is Robertson. That drops and it comes off an assist from Jordan. That's exactly what they had in mind on that possession. Now Paul. Shot on the wing. And Shaquille O'Neal pulls it down. Baylor with the ball. And it's Howard picking him up. Robertson outside. This is a dual knee. Pulls it up. Jumps up. Goes up high for the two-handed dunk. Major glass eating that time, fellas. That's just the kind of aggressive basketball he's known for. Yeah, it seems like we see that play from him almost every night. An offensive board that ends with a slam. Timeout called the Rockets. And so for the Rockets. Jason Terry has checked in for Lawson. Green comes in for Carmelo Anthony. And Lewis Williams subbed in for Chris Paul. Baylor against Terry. Fires for three. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. Jordan's got ten rebounds here. Oh, 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 oh. Guys, I'm going to need just a second to get myself together here. <laughs> Leaves you speechless, doesn't it, Clark? Huh? Wow. Man, I don't blame you, Clark. That dunk was unbelievable. And the replay, of course, presented by Sprite. What a play. Here's Green. Offline with his three. The Thunder leading by 14. Here's Bird. That's good. And Robertson with the assist. Bird's got eight. They are trying to pull away here, continuing to add to this lead. Well, Steve, no time is a good time to let up in my mind. I mean, you got to continue to just play the game no matter what the score is. No mercy being shown out there, and they're looking to pull away. I like that. Who's back up? Elgin Baylor again. He's got 17. Well, he brings a lot to the table, Kevin, that's for sure. And what I look to really... It's his pursuit of the ball. I mean, he gets you so many second chance opportunities because he anticipates so well and he plays with a, kind of a fearless aggressiveness. Boy, I love the purpose that he drives the basketball. When he gets into that lane with intentionality, once he gets his mind made up to attack the rim, he's hard to stop. Williams shot is off. Their offense seems completely out of sync here. They're on the wrong end of a big run. And then at the other end, it's been bucket after bucket after bucket, giving up a huge run here. 
we see more and more point guards with that kind of impressive dunking ability, don't we? Well, absolutely. We're seeing more and more of that kind of explosiveness. In fact, the point guard now has never been as prominent and as important, I think, in the game than it is right now. I agree. Some of that is the rule changes, guys. No hand checks. The floor is more spread. But, yeah, this new breed of athletic point guards so exciting. It's Terry outside. And good on the basket. Book it. Terry's got 12 points in the game. He's going to take that shot every time if he has that much room to get it off. He feeds it to Robertson. Working on Williams. They get the rebound. And it's going to be two free throws through contact on the shot. Take a look at what Baylor's been doing. He's got 10 rebounds and a huge helping of assists as well. Now, he's a maestro, Clark. I mean, the conductor of this offense putting on a fantastic performance. Just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. Terry, Baylor defending. Here's Terry. 12 points for him. And another three for Houston. He has looked very comfortable from three-point land today. Well, the bulk of his points, that's where they've come from. Robertson against Williams. And there's the call on Lewis Williams. That's his first foul for the Rockets. Ty Lawson, he's checked in for Terry. Johnson comes in for Green. And it's Harden in for Lou Williams. Here's Baylor. Hits the target from 18 feet. Baylor's got 21 in the game. Great display of that mid-range touch right now. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with taking a step in and knocking down a few. I know you were a great marksman from the three-point line, but sometimes people only see the game in threes and layups. That mid-range game is alive and well here tonight. Rockets have shot two of three from the free throw line tonight. And the Thunder making a switch here. Chamberlain's check in. The Thunder leading by 16. And there's the call on Howard. That is his first foul of the game. Chamberlain backing down. Off the inbound. Scooped up. And Smith with the block. And it's out of bounds. The Thunder able to retain possession. Now let's take a look back at which team led the NBA in scoring during the regular year. In third, the Rockets. I tell you what, Kevin, they've got to be really pleased with their performance in the regular season in terms of point production. I mean, they found scoring opportunities and made the most of them as a team. The work they've been doing in the offseason has clearly paid off. Elijah Wan's checked in for Chamberlain. Harden can't hit. Thunder have gotten half their shots to drop in the second half up to this point, going 7 of 14. Lawson's against Jordan. Lays it up, and despite of the excellent defense at that, Jordan's got 32 points in the game. Harden against Jordan. Harden kicks to Johnson. Six on the shot clock. Houston needs to get a shot. Robertson with the steal. It's three on three on the fast break. Here's Bird. Can't get it to go. And it's Houston the other way. Now a timeout called by Houston. But he looks like he wants to toy around with some of their sets and matchups here. You know, I don't think you can afford to go through a whole game doing the same thing over and over. And you have to be able to adjust on the fly, just like he's doing here. Carmelo Anthony has checked in for Houston. Paul comes in for Ty Lawson. And a new group in here for the... Oh, oh, man, what a play. I tell you what, you need to archive that one for the highlight tape. Oh, yeah, that, that is a keeper. You're correct. Man, that was incredible. Yeah, and those plays will give your team a huge boost. Here's Johnson. Buries it down low. Johnson's got a second bucket tonight. He is always so in control, guys. Even when he's going hard to the hoop. Very skilled finisher. Ball for three. No good. Iverson with some nice D. The Thunder leading by 18. To the middle. It's stolen by Smith. Here's the break. Here's Howard. Good foul there defensively. Makes him earn two points from the line. 
I agree with you. I mean, no freebies. Don't give anybody an easy opportunity. Make good use of your foul there. A right, different look for Oklahoma City. Larry Bird's checked in for Pacius Diakovic. And it's Jordan in for Magic Johnson. You know, for a player with his explosiveness, that was ATM time. Cash <laughs> money. The easy way. Yeah, that kind of defense is not going to cut it against him. Cash money. I like that, Clark. And Anthony gets it to go. What a half they're having from beyond the arc. It's getting ridiculous. And there's no reason they shouldn't keep attacking from out there. I mean, they've got it going on in a big way now. Paul, that's in there. Anthony with the assist. And it's 29 points for Chris Paul. Well, he stepped up this quarter, providing a hot hand to help carry them offensively. Iverson outside. Pass to Elijah Wan. Good work defensively by Smith. Hey, the defense was right there, just waiting, doing a nice job of anticipating that play. Steve, every team needs tough interior defense to be successful. The lead now cut to single digits. 31 points for Carmelo Anthony. The Thunder leading by nine. Iverson picks to Russell. Jordan covered by Anthony. Takes it up. A shot by Jordan, no good. Johnson dishes to Mello. Anthony right side. And Anthony gets double teamed. Paul for three. Out of bounds. Rockets ball as Houston keeps possession. A different look for Oklahoma City. Shaq is checked in for Elijah. Baylor comes in for Russell. And it's Robertson in for Allen Iverson. Anthony the pass to Paul. Five to shoot. Anthony sets the pick for Paul. Three-pointer. And the rebound goes to the Thunder. It's been a tale of two halves. My guys, he was on fire from long range in the first half, but not so much here in the second. You let him get to the rim, and that's exactly what's going to happen. Oh, you deserve that. Yeah, he's more than capable. You're right, Clark, of providing some great highlight real material. Yes, sir. And for a point guard to finish like that, I mean, that is just special. I'll tell you what, he's had an excellent game, and they're going to have to continue to rely on him if they're going to come back. And then slammed in by Jordan. Tearing that roof down with that one. Yeah, and really a dunk contest dunk that time. Wow. Mm. Yeah, unreal. What a dunk. Rockets trail by 10. Outside Anthony. No good on the three. Tough to hit that shot when you got the defense right in your shirt. Robertson kicks to Baylor. Good look. That's good. And Robertson with the assist. Baylor's got 10 points in just the second half. Anthony up on top, guarded by Jordan. From outside, off the mark. The Thunder leading by 12. Here's Baylor. That's in, coming off the assist from Robertson. Robertson's got assist number eight here in this one already. Robertson against Paul. Takes the three, gets it to go. Paul's got nine points in the quarter. And that's his first three of the second half after really lighting it up beyond the arc in the first. Jordan dishes to Baylor. Here we go. Back up. Oh. You know, it's really the kind of game you expect from him, guys. I mean, extremely efficient, taking a lot of good shots. Paul goes in. But three, count the bucket. Paul's got 35. That's 12 straight points coming off three-pointers. I mean, somebody do something defensively. Well, I, I agree with you. I mean, who's going to step up? I mean, they're rolling out there now, so you got to get in their chest, make them uncomfortable, and try to deny those looks. For the three, and there's the rejection. Paul, right side. From past the arc, and that one's good. Paul's got 38 points. This is unbelievable. What a shooting exhibition we're seeing out there today. Time called here. The Thunder decide to talk it over. They've been committing a lot of turnovers, and I imagine that's exactly what they're talking about right now. They need to tighten it up.
Smith in a whole new five on the floor. And Oklahoma City also making a switch. Dominique Wilkins, he's checked in for Michael Jordan. One oh six left in the third quarter. Back to Baylor. Hammers it all. And defensively, you want to keep the ball as far away from the hoop as possible. Yeah, because he's too good inside, Steve. I mean, he'll make you pay every time in there. It's stolen by Wilkins. Bird outside. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. Well, Larry Bird in this one, he's got eight points, and he's been credited to the steal today as well. Well, I'm sure he's happy to have a defensive contribution that he can point to in the box score. Bird hits them both. Wow, what a turnaround from the line this half. Not one foul shot in this yet. But when you have the lead, you're trying to close out games. You've got to make free throws, and that's exactly what they're doing. Terry against Robertson. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. That's his sixth three-pointer of the game. Three in each half. The Thunder leading by eight. There's 31 seconds left in the third quarter. Terry with it. 18 points for him. Left side, Terry. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. You know, we saw him struggle with his shot in the first half. But here in the second, he's managed to turn it around and be much more efficient. Bird outside. It's blocked. But they recover it. Robertson on the mark with the 15-footer. Robertson's got eight points here in this quarter. Well, and you love the way he searched for good shots all game long. And a great... Joe through three quarters as we enter the fourth. Who will carry the day? It's the... Welcome back. It's time for the fourth quarter and time to check in with the fourth member of our team, Doris Burke, to find out who had the Sprite uncontainable game. Doris? And Kevin, for that great stretch the Thunder put together, they get the uncontainable game award. A big run by them in the third quarter is the difference right now as they've opened up this game. Guys, one quarter left to play, but they look to be in complete control. Okay, Doris, thanks. That scoring run, guys, was pretty key in this game so far, don't you think? Yeah, very much so, Kevin. I mean, that was like a runaway train there for a while. No stopping them. Uh, that really blew the game open. Well, you bet it did. I mean, when you've got one team in such terrific offensive rhythm and the other guys on their back feet, tentative, hesitant, it almost always leads to runs like that. So with Paul on the bench. Here's the five for Kevin McHale right now. They've got Howard. Austin out there with Harden. Then it's Smith. And it's Anthony in at the three spot. Let's it go from deep. That's good. Anthony's got 12 points in just the second half. Wow. What can you say? Howard's shot is good. Now it's hard to set up your D when you've just turned it over at the other end. Yeah, a lot of points have been given up here, Steve, by way of turnovers on and their defense has just been short-circuited by their offense. Johnson gets to Baylor. Basket is good, the assist from Johnson. Johnson's got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. Jordan against Harden. It's Carmelo Anthony on the way. Fires from deep, and another three for Houston. You've got to give him a lot of credit for the way he's played personally trying to bring his team back. And the foul on Carmelo Anthony. That'll be his second foul of the game. Chris Paul, he's checked in for the Rockets. Then for the Thunder, Shaq is checked in for Chamberlain. Bird comes in for Baylor. And it's Robertson in for Magic Johnson. Second minute off the clock now in the fourth. Here's Jordan. Solid play on the low block, and that one's good. Jordan's got 38 points. And you got to love what he's been able to do with the ball in his hands in this game. Harden against Jordan. Harden the pass to Lawson. Paul. And some nice passing there by Houston. Shot clock at six. 
Elijah on against Anthony. And so it looks like the Rockets will retain possession here. Baylor, he's checked in for Elijah Wong. Just a little under two and a half minutes have passed now here in the fourth. And they'll turn it over. Could not get off a shot. 24 second violation. The Thunder leading by five. Robertson left side. And that one's good. Robertson's got 10 points in just the second half. Gotta love the finger roll up and over the defense. Paul dishes to Carmelo. Fires the three. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. Robertson's got three rebounds so far in the game. There's the feed to Burke. The pass to O'Neal. Baylor. And the rebound goes to the Rockets. Austin's got four rebounds now tonight. Now a timeout called by Houston. We've seen Michael Jordan really having a great game. We need to make some adjustments because he's absolutely scorching. Houston with a big group substitution here. Nene, he's checked in for Howard. Green comes in for Ty Lawson. Joe Johnson, he's checked in for James Hart. And it's Terry in for Chris Paul. Doris Burke has some information for us, Doris. Well, guys, Kevin McHale had some advice for the team in that last break. He let his players know that they've got to do a better job on defense. He said, they're scoring any way they want. We've got to show some pride here. Let's make a stand defensively, get a stop, and get on a run of our own. Do they have it in them, Kevin? Great. Thanks for the report, Doris. And all 10 of their last points have come inside the paint, so defensively you've got to make an adjustment. Yeah, and you got to do a little more to stop it, too. I mean, it's coming way too easy for them. At some point, you just got to buck up and say it's not going to happen. They have got to get a hand in his face. I mean, he's unconscious from out there. And here's Jordan outside. And it's Johnson with the rebound. Johnson's got his third rebound tonight. He's trying to get it going from outside. Outside, Terry. Elgin Baylor pulls it in. And if they know what's good for him, that's the way they'll defend against him every time he takes the ball into three-point territory. Well, you're right. Anything less than airtight defense on him will usually result in three points. Just too easy. They're getting whatever they want down there. You said it, Steve. Five straight field goals inside for him. The defense has to clamp down here. Terry against Robertson. And again, Jason Terry for three. Terry's got 30 points. No, he didn't have too much space to get that shot off, but for him, he had enough. He kicks it to O'Neal. He passes to Robertson. Terry covering. Here's Bird. That's in coming off the assist from Robertson. Robertson's got 10 assists here tonight. So active. Robertson against Terry, and it's sent back by Robertson. On the wing, Burke puts it up from 17, and it's good assisting on the play with Jordan. Rockets trail by six. Terry outside. Baylor on the double team. Here's Green. It's Nene, high post. Pass to Terry. Lock at six. The three is launched, and the shot is good. Terry's got 12 points now in the quarter. My goodness, it seems like he's got every point this quarter. Just an amazing job helping to cut into this lead. Baylor, that's him coming off the assist from Robertson. And the Thunder lead by five. Boy, both teams showing a lot of hustle, Clark. Steve, especially since halftime. I mean, they're flying around out there, giving up a lot of energy and putting together a pretty good show. Boy, look at the rebound totals. He is absolutely dominating out there. Boy, that's been something to watch. My goodness. Gets it to go. And it's a seven-point Thunder lead. 
Creating that kind of shot in close is really your primary objective every possession. Timeout call for Rockets. Well, he's got to get everybody on the same page. I mean, that's the reason for this timeout. And if that happens, I think they can improve and start playing better. You know, it's a coach's job to always try to be two or three steps ahead of the opponent and to look for that extra edge if you can. And I think he feels like he might have seen one. Houston with a big group substitution here. Dwight Howard, he's checked in for Anthony. Harden comes in for Green. Chris Paul, he's checked in for Joe Johnson. And Lewis Williams subbed in for Jason Terry. Paul with the ball. He's picked up by Jordan. And Chris Paul hits the three. Paul's got 41. Well, he can shoot the three. We know that. But I'm not sure that he does. I mean, they weren't anywhere near him on that possession. Bird kicks to Robertson. Outside Baylor. Here's the floater. Boy, well, blew the easy two by profile. Trying to look good. That's a bad decision and poor execution. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. Well, at least the defender got his money's worth on that one. Yep, that was an easy whistle for the official. And so Baylor nails both of them. Kevin, this is a strong free throw shooting team, and they've stayed true to form so far, converting with outstanding accuracy. Williams kicks to Howard. He dishes it to Paul. Harden against Baylor. Paul outside. Paul left side. Three pointer. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. Well, with a dead eye shooter like him, it takes more than average defense to put a stop to it. It takes great defense, and even that might not be enough. To tie it up. And it's good assisting on the play was Williams. Paul's got 47 points. It's been a humongous fourth quarter for him, especially from long range. He's in a groove, and that tray of his has just been dead. Here's Baylor. The Thunder with another miss. I like that. Trying to respond to that last three-pointer, but he couldn't get it to go. All up top to take the lead. Elgin Baylor with the rebound. Tough three-point try there with a hand in his face. Boy, you'd be lucky to make that one against great defense. Got that one up quick. Bird's got 12 points here in the second half. And he's been exactly what they needed here in the fourth. Boy, he looks like a dangerous man. I mean, he's made all four of his shots this quarter so far. That's good. 17 points for James Harden. And for the Thunder, they're shooting 65%. An outstanding offensive display from them. Kicks it to Bird. Working on Howard. Fades back. And it's Bird missing. And so it's Houston with it. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Harden outside. There's the dish to Williams. Outside Williams. To take the lead. And Shaq pulls it down. Shaq's got 11 rebounds in the game. Feeds it to Jordan. Fade away. Robertson kicks to Shaq. Down low. Oklahoma City moving it around. And there's Baylor. That's good on the assist by Bird. Baylor's got eight points in the quarter. Rockets trail. Ball passes to Williams. Straight up. Second shot opportunity. Howard. Good. shooting it brilliantly here late 60 percent from the field our timeout called by oklahoma city look at chris paul what a contribution he's dialed in from long range they got to stay in his hip pocket and deny him the catch houston with a big group substitution here Tyson Chandler, who's checked in for Nene. Smith comes in for Dwight Howard. Carmelo Anthony's checked in for James Harden. And it's Terry in for Lou Williams. That's good. 
And the Thunder lead by two. You know, they're just getting hammered inside. They really need to find a way to be tougher down there. They've got to be physical. they got to man up in there. I agree. I mean, you look at the points they're giving up. Most of them seem to be coming inside the paint. That was critical, guys. Absolutely critical. And, you know, that's what we're used to seeing out of him. Anthony, Baylor defending. From downtown, for Noah Anthony, and that's good. Anthony's got 43 points. Tell you what, he's been zeroed in on the hoop all quarter long, making big shots. Terry against Robertson. Inside, Jordan. Broke loose. That's good. Jordan's got 10 points in just the second half. This guy's putting on a clinic out there. Everything is sound and sharp and crisp. He's really the centerpiece of their offense. Paul picks to Smith. Dishes it to Carmelo. To take the lead. And another three for Houston. And he cannot play any better than he is right now in this quarter, guys. Now a timeout called by Oklahoma City. They're trailing by one. 119 left in the fourth quarter. Robertson left side. One on nine left in the game. Back to Bird. And Chandler sends it back. Anthony with it. He's picked up by Jordan. They push it up by himself. Oh! Great finish there, Kevin. Took it strong to the cup. Yeah, an aggressive two-handed jam. And that's the kind you like, especially in traffic. you got to make sure. That was a great angle we just saw, courtesy of Sprite. And here's Anthony for three. Good work defensively by Baylor. Defense didn't give him any space there. And I think we'll see them burn the clock a bit here. You know, I think that's probably a smart move. I think so, too. Stupendous. I love that word. Save that one. The word and the jam. I want to see it again. Just beautiful. You can't top that. I love the alley oop play. So much fun to watch. Five seconds separating the shot and game clocks. It's Terry outside. Can't get the three to fall. Money. And with a sensational bucket to bring them within one. Just a fantastic effort they're getting from Anthony right now. And they commit an intentional foul. You see another one of those so they can get into the penalty. Yeah, you can't let them pound the ball and just milk those precious seconds away. No other option here but to foul and hope for a few misses at the line. Gets the first, and that will put them up by two. So he gets them both, and it's a three-point game. Major pressure on those free throws, and it didn't phase him at all. A three-pointer now is the only option. It's Terry outside. The three won't fall. Not the best shot. Long range and with a defender right in his space. And defensively, that's the kind of work he's known for. I mean, he loves to lock you up. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a five-point game. That slams the door, guys. No chance they're getting back in the game after those free throws. The three. Good. Big time bucket there, Clark. 